So Saturday night around 11.15, we got called to 3141 Wallace Street for a report of a person shot. Uh, there we found 15-year-old uh, Javante Tilson with a gunshot wound. Um, he was pronounced dead at the scene. Uh, we are still working that now, <coughs> have been through the weekend, and so there's really not much more I can give you. Um, we know he was there with two, uh, or he was accompanied by two people, and as far as um, an assailant, uh, we know obviously at least uh, one, maybe two, or more. So um, that's, we're still working that today. It, it does appear to be targeted, um, and that's really all I have for you. If you have any questions on that now, I'll answer. You said two people. Do you know if they were both adults? The two that, uh, we're, with, we're with them? With, yeah. Yes. They weren't family members? I don't believe so. Uh, they could have been, but I, I don't know. Any information on where the um, juvenile went to school? I don't. One of the things the mother said at um, a vigil last night was that he was running door to door, knocking on people's doors for help. Is that something you guys are looking into, surveillance video? Um, and why was he, did he know he was being targeted? Mm -hmm. um, I don't know that, we're not sure on that yet. Um, there's a lot of things we still have to uncover, um, so. Was that house on Wallace Street his house where he was shot? No. Unrelated to? Unrelated to where he lives or any of his uh, or his his people that live. From our point of view, 15 years old is one of the youngest we've covered in recent years. Can you speak on kind of that impact? Yeah, obviously, um, when they're that young, our victims and you know, of course, every victim to every victim's family is is you know the most outrageous and the most important. But um, yeah, to see our youth. Um, you know, getting hurt like that is very disturbing to us. And of course, we're going to work hard to make sure that whoever did this is is uh, brought to justice. Do we know where the shooters are from? Is there a, are they from town? Are they from province? Are they from another town in the area? Like, do we have an idea? About we're still working that now. Still early, um, though we are on it and we're pushing along. It's still early. Do you mind spelling um, his name? Uh, G E R V O N T A T I L S O N. And you have any information about the firearm as well? No. Did we, I mean, we do have some information, but none to give out to the public yet. Did a neighbor end up calling 911? Do you know who made that call? Yeah, there's a few people that called. So. Any other witnesses cooperating? Uh, we have some cooperation. I mean, obviously, we have like 100% cooperation, but we usually don't get that. But we, we certainly make do with, with what we have. This is our fifth murder. Four previous ones have been solved. So uh, we're going to do our best to get this one solved. So. Was Ray for you to be the first murder this year? This year. We don't know. We don't know. That hasn't came up yet, so, but we, we don't know. Okay. Any more questions on that? All right. Uh, I guess last question, any message that you'd like to share or send to the family as of right now? I've already spoken to the family privately and, or at the scene, and uh, they've talked. They know, you know, you know our feelings here and how we're, we're you know, 100% behind them, and of course, we'll help them through whatever we can do. Okay.